हेलो फ्रेंड्स दिस इज आवर चैनल शॉर्टकट टू पास एम यू दिस इज आवर थर्ड वीडियो ऑन टॉम वन फॉर ऑफ कैम्प मेकैनिजम्स न्यूमरिकल सो फॉर सॉल्विंग द न्यूमरिकल्स यू हैव टू प्रिपेयर सम फॉर्मुलाज द फॉर्मुलाज आर गिवन बिलो फॉर डिस्प्लेसमेंट इट इज जीरो एस बाय टू एंड एस एंड राइट हैंड साइड देर इज वाई जीरो वाई टीटा बाय टू एंड वाई टीटा The tetas will be given in the question. Okay, you don't need to worry. Velocity. For velocity, there is a formula. This formula can be carried forward for the next two for the next formulas for acceleration. You have to just uh, you have to just remember this formula. For u r m, it is two s omega upon theta zero. Okay. So and You have to remember that for velocity at zero and at theta, the value is zero, and for the value of theta at half of the angle is two s omega by theta zero. Okay, and then for acceleration, for acceleration you have to remember that at theta by two the value is zero, and for the first term there is a positive term and a negative term. The the This formula can be derived with the help of this formula. Just you have to take s outside of these terms from velocity, and you have to just square. That is equal to four omega square theta square, four omega square theta square into s. Okay. Here it is positive, and here it is negative. Do remember positive and negative sign. Okay. This may cause some problem in your paper while solving. Okay. The jerk for u a r m. For U R M, the jerk is infinity, infinity, and infinity. For return stroke, for the return stroke, it's just the vice versa of the out stroke. Okay, so in return stroke there is actually S for uh, theta zero plus theta d. The theta d angle will be given in your. It is the dwell angle. Okay, the dwell angle, the dwell angle will be given in your question paper, which is equal to S for return stroke, and for further it is. Theta plus dwell angle plus the theta r by two. The return angle for theta will be given in your question paper. You need not need to worry. Okay, and it's the just the vice versa. Here it is positive, here it is negative. Here it is positive, here it is negative. Here negative, here positive. Okay, so no need to worry. You have to just remember one formula. And for displacement, the displacement value for U A R M and S H M both are same. Okay, you need not need to worry for velocity in S H M in S H M the velocity the formula is pi theta pi by theta zero s by two and omega. Okay, this is the formula for the velocity in S H M. So velocity it follows the same path as the U R M. In which the first and last term is zero, and here in acceleration the middle term is zero. But the main difference is that it has a formula for jerk. Okay, the you need to just remember one formula, and rest is the square of this formula with s by two outside, and here it is the cube of this formula with s by two outside. You can see theta pi upon theta zero into omega. The cube is this sum into x by two, and the square. Is this sum into x by two? Okay, it goes same as U R M. The S H M part, the return for the return stroke, it follows the same part, similar part. Okay, and remember here it is negative and here it is positive. Many of you people will get confused while writing in exam. So do write and practice these formulas. Okay, you may. You may forget this while writing the paper, so do write the formulas and remember it properly. Numericals. Now let's solve one numerical on the question asked in May 14 on the graph of cam and cam mechanism. The question is a um, cam with a minimum radius of 25 mm is to be designed for a knife edge follower with the following data to raise the Follower through 35 mm. This is our displacement, that is S, during 60 degree rotation of cam. The 60 degree is the theta zero, that is the outstroke theta, which is given in the question. 
okay so second part dwell for next 40 degree of the cam rotation 60 degrees outstro angle 40 degrees dwell angle and descending on the follower during the next 90 degree of the cam rotation 90 degree is the return angle okay dwell during the rest of the cam rotation if now the further question is if the ascending and descending of the cam is with shm and urm as you can see the ascending is shm and descending urm that means that means that the cam follows shm while outstroke and urm while return stroke okay so you have to just so you have to just use this formula for outstroke and this return formula for return stroke okay so let's solve the numerical first write of first write down the given there is if the cam rotates at 150 degree rpm this is the end that is cam speed cam speed it is 150 rpm omega you can calculate omega with with the help of n the omega is 2 pi n upon 6c so we get 15.7 radian per second okay outstroke of follower is 35 mm given outstroke of cam is 60 degree the angle of outstroke is 60 degree return stroke is 90 degree and dwell angle is 40 degree okay so just according to the formula sheet to so just put in the values just you have to put in the values like you can see here you have just put in the value s is 35 so it's 17.5 it is 35 like pure return and the main part the main part to remember is in exam is that the theta 0 while putting the value of theta 0 you have to remember that it should be in radian the theta angle is given in six in degree you have to convert it into radian by dividing it by pi by 180 do remember it most of the students fail to do this and that's why they score zero in this numerical do remember the main thing of this numerical is that you have to convert degree into radian okay so first term is zero and uh, for half angle that is 60 by 2 that is 30 degree it is the formula you have to apply this formula just put in the terms in calci and you will get the answer for 60 degree it is 0 okay now for acceleration for acceleration it is positive pi square theta theta 0 square okay remember that theta 0 is in radian okay so 60 into pi by 180 the whole square s is 35 upon 2 into omega okay just put in the values in the formulas and you will get the answer and for jerk for jerk you remember that the formula just first and last value is 0 and remember the minus sign in the jerk most of the people forgot to write the minus sign okay here is the minus sign 0 minus and 0 so the jerk is just putting the terms and the jerk is minus 182 one eight two eight point five two meter per second cube okay don't forget to write the dimensions okay meter per second meter per second meter per second the follower moves with a uarm in return stroke okay displacement is given by okay now it follows a urm so let's take the urm from us okay as you can see in return stroke it is first term is s second term is x for is x by 2 and third term is 0 okay you to just put in the values and you will get the answers so for v at 100 v at 100 how we get 100 it's 60 plus 40 that is equal to 100 according to the given t and then v theta of 0 v theta by 2 okay that is minus 2 s omega 
upon theta r remember you have to convert in into radians okay just put in the values and you will get acceleration and even zero remember for acceleration it is minus and plus okay for return stop and you have to just plot these values in the graph so let's start plotting the values as you can see displacement is you, have, you can take any scale but do remember to put proper values at proper places for example here 0 30 degree 60 degree make sure that your graph gets complete between these two ends okay get proper scale for it okay so let's start 0 30 degree 60 degree this is the dual angle of 40 degree okay then 100 145 and 190 after that you have to just plot the graph and remember for shm for the first start shm it is a curve and for urn the displacement graph is a straight line okay do remember it while while solving the paper okay and remember do practice the graphs okay i don't know which book you are referring but the book which i referring do practice it do solve five to six terms on this topic okay to get practice on this properly and get full 14 marks from this numerical in your exam so velocity the velocity graph the velocity is 0 0 and 0 0.28 meter per second as you can see we have plotted here it is a curve okay and acceleration no acceleration is acceleration is first value is positive 38.82 second value is 0 0 at half angle 30 degree and for the 60 degree it is minus 38.82 so it is a curve okay do remember that it is a curve and for jerk for the 0 0 and the middle value is minus 1828.52 so as you can see we have plotted here properly and then comes the dwell okay this is dwell and then it is uarm for uarm 35 degree as you can see 35 mm 17.5 mm and 0 mm just you have to look at the angle and plot the values 35 17.5 and 0 okay and for velocity first and last time is 0 and for it is for it is for return so, so there is a minus sign over here so minus 0 0.699 minus 0 0.699 meter per second after that acceleration remember that it is a straight line okay for shm it was a curve and for urm it is a straight line and for acceleration you have to just put in the values in the graph minus 13.98 plus 13.98 and remember it is a square it is a rectangle it is a rectangle for you shm it was a curve and for here it is a rectangle do remember these things in exam you may forget these things which are main thing you which will help you to score more marks in the exam okay and then jerk for jerk it is infinity 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 okay so jerk is infinity for this so your graph totally looks like this okay as you can see so this will help you to fetch 14 to 14, 10 to 14 marks in your paper so that's it for from this chapter thank you do like share and subscribe our channel this is shortcut to pass mu thank you